Sagittarius, welcome to your Berkeley 2 tarot and this reading is for the first half of September. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Sagittarius. What you can expect in this first half. Ten of chalices. Ten of swords. of chalices four of wands Knave of Pentacles. So here you have Ten of Swords. With this Ten of Swords, uh, Sagittarius looks like someone is in, you know, depression. With this Ten of Swords, this person is feeling that they cannot move, they cannot decide for themselves. This person feels that uh, something is uh, ripping them apart and uh, they just can't collect themselves. This person is unable to, you know, control their emotions. They are unable to find the balance. This is not only affecting this love life, but uh, it's also affecting their work and health. This person feels like um, if they cannot get over this feeling, you know, everything is going to fall apart. They won't be able to help themselves. Seems like this was someone who couldn't give you the commitment you deserved and um, they chose to walk away or they chose to stay silent and uh, now they feel that, uh, you know, this is something they cannot ignore. This person had this idea that um, they will get over this connection, they will move on or probably um, you will forget about this uh, whole episode and uh, you know things will be better but this person knows that this is not going to happen you want something serious you want something real and in fact uh, this person has now realized that you deserve it well as well because you are this queen of chalices they know that you are full of life you are full of love you are full of uh, you know confidence and charm and everyone is attracted towards you this person knows if you choose to, you can definitely find someone and uh, they are realizing that they have broken your heart. This person is now feeling the same pain once they made you feel. In fact, it's more than that. They have also got guilt and shame. And uh, with this Ten of Cups, this person had this idea that uh, they can keep you waiting, they can go according to their timeline and uh, you know still you two will be together, you will always be there, of course you had a beautiful relationship, seems like you people were too much into each other, it was something uh, that hardly happens in this world, but you people had it, you had this beautiful connection, but at the same time this person couldn't understand what they had. And uh, because of this, this person is now with these Ten of Swords. They don't know how to deal with, they don't know how to uh, take the next step. Also, we have Four of Wands here. 
seems like now this person is feeling that uh, they need to give you a commitment, they need to um, show you how much they love you, they need to tell you that uh, still you two can be together. So it seems like uh, slowly and you know, you can say that this person was not uh, ready to change, but slowly and gradually they are changing. And with this knave of pentacles, uh, the progress may be slow, but it's happening. And this person will bring you this pentacle. I mean, the things you deserve and you always wanted. This pentacle is about commitment. So um, you can expect something uh, you are not expecting. And um, you know that is because this person has realized that uh, they cannot stay away from you. They just cannot. We have a lot of cups here, so probably you are dealing with a water sign. Though of course that's not so necessary because this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. The heart of Six of Wands. Ace of Wands. Four of Pentacles. So here we have debt. This person is now feeling that uh, they should uh, put end to this pain. This person is trying to end the issues between you two. And in fact, they are working on themselves. This person feels that uh, there is only one way of getting out of this is uh, reconciliation. This person feels that uh, they need to be wise with the Hierophant. Uh, they're now thinking that they should use their wisdom. They shouldn't be sticking to their ego or something else. This person knows that if they choose to uh, do what is right, they will certainly get your forgiveness. They will get another chance and uh, they will get whatever they are looking for. Because Six of Wands is about victory. Also, we have Ace of Wands next to Six of Wands. So clearly, you are also going to get something that you have been waiting for. If you are waiting for explanation from this person, it's coming for you. Also, with this Four of Pentacles, seems like um, this person needs your support. They have understood that uh, without you, they are incomplete. Without you, they cannot uh, do whatever they were doing. This person knows that uh, you are their other half and uh, you know they cannot uh, be happy without you. They can exist, but they won't be living. Let's check an oracle message for you. Lord Ganesh, infinite abundance. Obstacles are being removed, spiritual support and connections are increasing. So your obstacles are being removed. The universe is working at its best to keep you two together. And um, you know whatever it takes uh, to be back, this person will do. 
they already have this intuition that uh, you are the one and they need to stop you before you choose something else or before you go somewhere else they don't want to lose you so this was the reading for the first half of september i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye